Excuse me. I hope you are not planning to steal that motorbike. Actually, I imagine Hagrid would be fine with me taking her for a spin. It is mine after all. Uh, uh. Oh, Mr. Potter. I am sorry. I did not know it was you. Quite all right. It is rather conspicuous to be skulking around all by myself, isn't it? Huh. Not at all. But did you say it was your motorbike? Ah. I did. I loan it out to Hagrid now and then. Honestly, I think he gets more enjoyment out of it than I do. Mm -hmm. He does love to ride it. Although, I thought it belonged to a friend of his, Sirius Black. Mm -hmm. You're right. And then Sirius left it to me. Ah, Seeing this old thing always reminds me of him. Today is his birthday. Or would have been. Oh. oh, I am sorry. Sirius was your godfather, wasn't he? Oh. He was. He and my father were best mates in school. Thick as thieves, as they say. They did everything together. Including getting into quite a bit of trouble. <laughs> in fact, Sirius told me about one such misadventure that involved this very motorbike. It flies, you know. Ah. Yes, I know. Hagrid took me for a ride once. Uh -huh. Did he? Well, it was not flying when a pair of policemen cornered Sirius and my father in a dead-end alley. Apparently, they had been exceeding the speed limit by a considerable amount. Mm. It is very fast. Mm. What happened? Were they arrested? Uh -uh. No. Apparently, the only reason they were speeding in the first place was because they were being chased by three wizards on broomsticks. Uh-oh. Oh no. Were they Death Eaters? Actually, I am not sure. Sirius never said. He and my father did, however, manage to magically lift the policeman's vehicle so that their pursuers crashed straight into it. <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> yes, well... It was definitely a shock for the muggle policeman, and I would guess the sight of Sirius and my father riding the motorbike into the night sky left them even more perplexed. <laughs> wow, that sounds amazing. <laughs> and quite reckless. Sirius was never known for his good judgment. Would you believe he got me a toy broom for my first birthday? Oh, really? That does seem a bit young to start flying. Precisely. Shall we take it for a spin? <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more content, and we'll see you in the next episode. Uhtred, I've grown quite fond of your cupcakes, and was wondering if you might be willing to part with one for me after the event is over? Ivy, don't you think you're consuming too much sugar. I'm worried about you. She was always like that, so we called her Sugar Ivy back at home. Hey Winifred, wait a second, that's not true.